after five, six months of getting to the point where we can restore power in the building, which has included needing to get permits, electrical engineers, I mean, it's been daunting. And all the while, you know, the asset sitting and costing me money instead of making me money. Um, and we find, you know, then the last piece is like figuring out this wire because electrical is incredibly important to be done carefully because the only thing that has the potential to kill someone. You know, literally, and so the kind of wire that you use is all, you know, needs to be approved by inspectors and how you do it and the angle. I mean, there is nothing that isn't reviewed in electrical work. It's my first time doing it, uh, learning a lot, but I just found out that we picked up the wrong wire. And a wire is expensive, very expensive, very heavy. You have to go to remote places to pick that shit up. Man, I ain't trying to go back there because I was there yesterday. Let's see. Hey. It takes forever to get our set, man. It's happening again. Like, what the fuck are you supposed to do? What's up, guys? Um, How you doing? I honestly don't. I honestly think. Colonial so screwed up, and they should get us. And they should get his brand new wire. I think so, dude. I I, I go all over to find a sticker for that. This is yep. the sticker that came on that fucking. That's the roll. first thing they asked me and for. And that's the first thing I read yesterday. When yeah. I read that sticker yesterday, it said 250. I'm like, we're good. Yep. They cut. Nobody thought they cut everything out. And, and how'd you like find out by the thickness? I came back and yeah. I'm like, this, right there. something don't look right. I went up there and read it, and sure enough, yeah. So the the, the darker one is a 350. Okay. And this stuff is 250, which. It Hands. wouldn't if I if I had a bigger size conduit, it wouldn't be right. a big deal. Totally I'm maxed out on conduit fill and ambient temperature, so I can't. And it's all got to be the same shit, otherwise, yeah. like they'll flip yeah, out. Yeah, otherwise, you know what we're gonna do. It's a good fucking catch. Yeah, I'm like, fuck. Thank God, the first one that's in it's is all two fifty. All the two, the wire we brought okay. back this morning. Okay. Okay. Cool. It's and this one we got to deal with now. Okay. And did we get to a third one, or did we catch it at the second? Did we got Caught it at the second. second. Okay. The first one in is good. We can pull this back out, maybe. Okay, okay. It's gonna be a fight. We're gonna have to tie a truck to it. We're tying the bucket to it and you raise the bucket. Well, there's oh. no way you can move by hand. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. Okay. All right. So the first thing they asked for was a tag. Let me let me give my buzz. So Let's see at what's this point, I'm probably screwed in my end. So the only thing I can do is probably start packing up. Totally. And I got it because the only reason I'm saying I wouldn't be completely done here today. Yeah. I'm scared to be done. Yeah, here. no, I so know, man. I have stuff lined up like this right after this. Boom, 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 boom. I know. So now, I know. We, we snuck in a two day window. Oh, you know? shit. Um, All right. It's just going to be. I understand. I got everything else. Um, I got the CT, I got our connection points and everything else. Yep. Um, I had to get Call Sam the Draper. Can you even get me a phone? And the cuts? Yeah. Side there. Yeah. Like that's gonna be the quickest, easiest way. And what's that made out of? What's this? Yeah. yeah. I have I have a big crimper that took a shit last week. So hey, I uh, can you transfer me to uh, Sam? Sam Draper. Sure. One second. Thanks. All right. Um. Damn, it looks fucking good though. Hey, Sam. Sam, dude, this is gnarly. So I just looked at the tag. It's 250 thn. Right. And. That's exactly what it says. But it's the wrong wire. Yeah, they sent the wrong wire. Yep. Okay. All right. So what do we do? Do we just run back there? Yeah, uh, I mean, we just swap it. I mean, if you were able to do that, they're just going to swap it. They're not yeah. Protest. I mean, I emailed them and just all right. stated they're at lunch right now, but yep. my only concern is... Yeah. I'm going to have... It's... Yeah, we lost a day. We, anything, let me just verify they actually have that. Yeah, I mean, they will. It's a common wire. I'm going to just, 
I'm, get, I'm catching a flight right now to Arizona, and I won't be back. And then these guys are jammed up. Uh, what, do you want, what do you want me to do to solve this? Is there call call them. Do? Yeah, just if you don't mind, just letting them know that they. I will, that's already done. Right, great. And then that I'll come back. Hold on one second. Uh, just let them know I'm going to come back Friday for the right wire. I can bring them and. I'm going to copy you on the email right now. Yep, but just let them know the wire's been cut. The wire has been cut. Oh, you shouldn't have done that. No, this is not a we shouldn't have done anything, dude. We got the wrong fucking wire. We're going to do what we have to yeah, do. Hold on a minute, hold on a minute. How did they not know that when they were cutting it? Because it's all labeled 250, and you don't find out until. You take a really close look. Why would if it's if it's the How color it's supposed to be? We cut the whole strip, dude. All 80 foot pieces. We're almost done with this job. The wire has been cut. I mean, how does he not know that? Because basically, I can't return it now. I, mean, I, know. I don't know how, you, yeah, how can he not know that it's a 250? Like, did he not look at it? Dude, it looks ex almost exactly the same, dude. All he's got to do is read the print. Like, I mean, like, it, but if it, the packaging says 250, dude, if it's labeled the wrong way, why would you assume... No, why would you assume that the material is anything other than what the packaging says? Like, if the packaging says it's one thing, and then the tag says it's one thing, and it looks just like that thing. Why on earth would you, like, why? Just to clarify, it is true they sent the wrong wire. That I'm not disputing. Right, so, and we fucking cut it because we're looking to finish. I mean, it's stated every single Like, if he's just not looking at it at all. Damn. Like, I don't understand that. I don't know, man. Uh, to me. I'm telling you, I mean, I'm just answering it. The electrician, I think. Yeah, that, I think that's I think that's beside the point, man. We got r incorrectly labeled material. You know, we found out post we cut it. I think. So here's what I'm willing to do. Like we take that shit back. But but are they gonna are they gonna own their the mistake? That's the gray area, right? It's like it's there. It's like both. You know. They labeled it incorrectly, dude. I don't know what to tell you. What? Are you getting on the flight right now? No, I'm, I'm getting on the flight at 2 p.m. Or I'm, I'm flying out, heading to the airport at 2, flying out at 4. All right, all right. Well, let me do this. Because you and I are going to have to figure this one out because I'm going to probably end up paying for this. I wouldn't let you pay for it. I'm happy to pay for it. You've done enough. But, you know, it's just like, dude, it's just fucking. I mean, it is, honestly, man, just, just let me vent for a minute. We put on every single invoice. If you cut the wire, you own it. I mean, that is just total. And no, normally, we never have any issues because they at least are seeing what they have. And I know you would, you didn't do it yourself, but it's like picking up an iPhone and being surprised it's not an Android. Like it, it's it's right in your hand. It says it every six inches. Yeah, but I have I have. See that is just shocking. To me. I I give you that, but uh, but also, dude, you know. It's the packaging says it, the tag says it's one thing. I, when I no, when I it's not irrelevant, dude. It's like it, it's not. It, no, no, you know what this is like? It's like if you buy an iPhone that's an iPhone 8s, and no, 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 no. If you buy an iPhone 8s and and then you but you think you buy a 10 and you don't realize it's an 8s, like they're fucking similar, dude. And I just want to make it clear it's printed. I understand, so, dude. I understand. Anyway, 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 Sam, Sam. Um, so I, I just, I need the wire. I don't care if I have to pay for it. I'll let you do it. Let me see what they'll let me do first, and then I'll text you. That's all. That's all. Call them and let them know, and tell them we have the proof. All right, and just. Well, we have it in four pieces now. Yeah, that's that's fine, dude. I don't care what the fucking protocol is. Just let them know, and then let them know that. Just, just first, firstly, we let them know, hey, look, this is a grave mistake, man. You cost us the job. Like at this point, dude, these guys aren't gonna come back here for two weeks. I paid them for the day, 
and like it's, it's just it's gonna cost me personally a lot of money because they packed it incorrectly wait don't do don't cut me off it's gonna cost me a lot me personally me it's gonna extend my carrying costs like this is an incredibly expensive mistake and yeah, I understand it's printed on the material, but like it's incorrectly labeled, dude. And when I dropped it off, I personally checked to me. I mean, I'm not doing the job, but I personally checked to make sure what it was before any, I let anything proceed. And, you know, we got going. And anyway, it's it's a big headache. So just see what they can do. Um, I'm willing to, you know, if push comes to absolute shove and we get nowhere, you know, I still need the wire. So I'm going to have to buy it. But. If they're willing to cover half, I would entertain that because to me it seems like halfway thing here. Half their fault, half my fault. But, um, but you know, if they want to fucking eat it and sell me the, you know, it's a massive warehouse, man. All right, all right. It's a massive warehouse. I'm sure they have fucking 300, you know, feet of 250 KCM. All right, all right, all right, man. All right, let me know. Thanks, bye. All right, they say they're gonna see what they can do, but I made the fucking case. Oh man, I would fucking, I would fucking snap on their ass. Yeah, I made the case. I mean, I let him know. Um, all right. Let me go see and lock up. I'll be right back. That is so unfortunate. Wow. Not mad or anything. It's just we were supposed to have power today, bro. Today. That makes such a big difference. In so many ways, man. Like once you can light the building, it's just it goes from like vac like abandoned to like, okay, it's just empty. In a way. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter like whose fault it is. It's just like, it just sucks. Oh man, oh, shit. You just kind of breathe through it, but then you just keep remembering, all right, it's actually not happening. No big deal, but it sucks. Hey. Hey, what's up? Um, I guess not a whole lot, man, other than just the wrong wire. Yeah, so what are we going to do? What's the plan? Well, I called Sam. Dude, it's just a difficult guy to deal with, actually. I just, that was like, that was the final moment where I realized, like, all right, yeah. It's just a difficult guy to work with. Sam's, Sam's a fucking pain in the ass. Yeah, so. yeah. But he hooked up the wire, so, but anyway, he just, like, insisted on, like, how could you not notice kind of, kind of move. Forget, dude, just forget about Sam. So what are we going to do? Well, get, uh, get new wire? dude, I don't know. I just fucking found hey. out. So, all right, well, we're, we're calling, say, we're hey, calling the warehouse okay. just to see what they'll do. Apparently, it's like only one out of every hundred get the, the wrong thing. We had the tag, it's the wrong, or it's the right tag. And even like the, the wrapping has the right thing. And they even look similar. So like, thing is that- How do you know? Jamie knows? Well, yeah, Jamie stepped, stepped away today. Once he set his guys up, he stepped away. And when he came back, he would, and they didn't do the hooking without him. So they were getting ready to do these hookings. Oh God. And so Jamie when he- found out he came in, yeah, and he's like, oh, fuck, this is the wrong wire because he checked up. At Sam's point is it's printed every six inches. It's, it tells you what kind of wire. But I don't know, in defense of them, like, I personally, when I dropped it off, looked at the, the, th 
thing it said 250 THN. Okay, it's blue, perfect. Like that's exactly what we need. You know, I got them going. Um, and yeah, the tricky thing is like they snake some of that conduit and it's like you, you snake it with a machine. It's like you can't do this shit by hand. It's in there good. And they're jammed up in the schedule for the next two weeks. So, you know, bef yes, yeah. We'd have to get in a whole other permit and like, uh, it's oh going to be, I uh, know, man. What's I know. the alternative? I mean, that can't be the best answer. They, Jamie won't let his schedule slide a little bit. You just wasted from Jamie's position. So Jamie's position is going to be that, that you supplied the wire, you supplied the wrong wire, you wasted his time. So he's not going to want to do anything for free. Nah, and I don't, I don't expect him to, man. Oh, he, he's, he's been a great professional, man. He came here, like they just do their thing. They cleaned up yesterday and locked up like really well they're just professional like you just don't have to be babying them like you did with Ernie and all these other guys um and yeah man he caught it and and but they still wasted a fucking day and a half huh <sighs> yeah I mean but they finished doing all the conduit today so they didn't waste any time I mean at, there was no time I came that they were like not efficiently like these guys clearly do this uh, I would still yo I would still tell the wire company First of all, they need to exchange wire for free, but secondly, they wasted a bunch of time. Exactly. So I called so Sam, and he immediately he was like, well, that electrician who we haven't been seeing eye to eye. I told him, dude, enough with that bullshit. Just call the company yeah. and, and um, let them know that they screwed up. And you know, if I have to cover out of pocket 100%, I'm going to do it. It doesn't matter. We have to get it done. If they'll come halfway, it's 50-50, great. But the, their, their invoice clearly says I have it. It's like... Um, it says, you know, if you cut it, you own it. Like, you know, it's all up to debate up until you cut it. So anyway, we cut it. It's, it's all good. Co it's copper, right? It's hundreds of pounds of copper. Yeah, and it's all fucking cut. And it's, it, but yeah, yeah. We can take it to the scrap yard and scrap it for a deposit on the facade. Like it's worth, dude. It's worth a lot of money. <laughs> Just because you cut it doesn't mean it's. You it's know, worthless, it's, right? Yeah. To try to get them to send you. Um, All right, wire that's a good idea. Free. That's a good idea. Try get, and then, yeah, try to get them to send you wire for free. Exactly, and then take that and fucking scrap it, and then use that as a down payment on the next project. <laughs> yeah, whatever, whatever. Oh my God, yo, real estate people have to be so savvy. It's ridiculous. Yeah, just thrifty. Whoo! All right, I'm with so, it. Let's do that. Let's. That's the try, plan. Try to get free wire. If you get free wire, you made a couple thousand bucks today. But I also lost a couple thousand bucks, so we're net neutral. Um, you know, but well, because, um, because we set, we're set back two weeks and it's going to cost us another month pretty yeah. much. So, yeah, and which is $3,000. So yeah, of course, of course. And then we'll scrap that wire. We'll figure out how to do it. Some places we'll even pick it up for you because it's so valuable. But, um, okay. and then we'll have a few thousand bucks. All right. Sounds good. So, I'll let you know how it goes. All right. Is there anything else? Yo, key in the lock box. Keys in the lock box. Miracles are happening, man. The water heater is getting installed tomorrow. The electricity's on. It sounds like we're going to pass our inspection. You got the architect there, even though I'm opposed to starting that. I'm opposed um, right now. I'm opposed right now. A little bit like in, you know, I don't want to wait a year is what I'm saying. Like, I want to, yeah, like, no, three months is good for me. Like, I want to. That's um, a waste of money. But it's like Satch just made it a hefty real estate investment. He's got, mark he's got money in the markets and, like, this will be his real estate investment probably for the next 12 months, 15 months. I want to buy three or four properties next year. So I'm not now, you know, I've told you that a couple of times. So I'm not trying to start anything in Allentown at the, you know, I want to finish 220. I want to finish one, three, four, but then I want to buy shit. I don't want to spend time like this isn't, you know, yep, yep, no. pass this pretty quickly. So I don't want the storefront sucking me dry while I'm trying to expand. Yep. Yep. I agree. I think that's a good point. Um, you know, yeah, I'm just saying I'm going to be ready soonish. Like I don't like to let things drag because otherwise we'll sit on this, like it might end up being fuck around two years and then it's still I know, vacant. I know. But so, I, I, I will not be ready financially to issue $10,000 spring until after the re until after the refinance. Oh, well, obviously. Yeah. We're not starting. We're not starting pre refi. I think we start at the springtime because I do not want to get fucking diluted after all that fucking work because I can't come up with a CapEx for the storefront. But that wouldn't even happen because that's too irrational and unreasonable at this point. Yeah, 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 exactly. But like if you and Satch both dump 10K in and I got nothing. Dude, Sam, dude, Satch isn't dumping into anything right now. You don't think so? No, no, he's not. 
Okay, no. so we're good. All right. All right, cool. All right. Toss in. Good stuff. All right, bye. Dang, dude. Crazy.